Hey there, it's Marty with Digital Design Tips. Today I'm going to show you how to make a radial or circular uh, gradient and a couple other things about gradients. Let's see here. Pull up the gradient uh, palette and we're going to need some color. We'll look at the swatches and we'll start. We'll just, I just hit M button. There we go. Rectangular tool. Uh, make a square and we are now ready to put a gradient in there. So if you just click gradient, it's going to use uh, the standard you know, left to right, black and white. Um, if you want to make a radial, you see here there's radial and then there's freeform. So radial is going to be a circle and freeform is going to have uh, even more points you can draw with. But if you uh, see that I'm going to drag this red guy under there and now let's do yellow over here. We now have uh, we've changed the color there, and you can see we can even do it more there. Now it's just a radial one, and you can uh, toggle in here. Sorry, I gotta let go before it shows you. Um, you know, the differences, uh, in the amount of color for uh, each part, and if you want to add more, uh, you can go here and watch this. This gets really neat. You can drag that there uh, into these circles. Uh, if you don't, it's just going to fill the whole thing like that. So, that, so don't do that. Uh, okay, I did pink though. And brown, just so you can see what this looks like. See that? Then you can even drag these guys around uh, to mess with it, make it even bigger, or smaller. Uh, really neat stuff with the gradients there. You can go back to the radial one that I was doing earlier. And uh, that's about it for uh, uh, radial gradients and freeform gradients. I uh, hope that helps you. And uh, thanks for watching. Check out my other videos if you uh, need anything else.